Hello, Hello what's up, bro? People, just so happy to see you here. Oh my gosh. Hey, blogger. Hey, blogger. Hello. Thank you. Hey, Joel. Hey, welcome man. to Lion Hall. Thank you. So many people here saying welcome to the Philippines. It's beautiful. It's honestly, honestly awesome. Magandag Umaga once again here from Manila. And I'm just crossing the street here. It is a bustling, crazy, wild Saturday morning here in the metro area. And I have yet to really hit up a proper market here in Manila. So I'm thinking it's about time we do that. And you know, the guard, the guy working at my hotel, hopefully the pronunciation, I've already lost it, but I'm pretty sure it's Divisoria. The Divisoria market is where we're going to be going. Uh, before that, if I'm gonna make it any farther here, I really need to get myself... What's up, bro? How's it going? <laughs> I really need to get myself some uh, caffeine because that's where I'm at. So, crossing the street is always a So let's try to figure out how to do this. Maybe I'll follow the locals here and maybe we'll try to get across the street. Once again, and it's challenging because I have to go over there. So you have to kind of like go out of your way to get over there. It is what it is. Now I did stumble upon this market at nights a few a few nights ago when I was recording a video, a mall video. But it was an interesting scene at nights. Uh, if you've not seen that video, I'll definitely link it below. But I want to see what it's actually like here. Uh, at a normal time so I think it's about 1130 right now another late start for me <laughs> here in Manila I'm trying to catch up on sleep but I definitely feeling like I need something other than coffee right now um, I think we're gonna go for an energy drink see if they have any special Red Bulls like they do in Bangkok if you don't know in Thailand there are special energy drinks there But let's see what we can find. Wow. Here they are. Red Bull Supreme. Okay. I think we'll go with the Red Bull Supreme because I have no idea what this is like. Got B vitamins. So. Oh, that's loud. Red Bull Supreme. Tastes like Red Bull. Tastes like what you get in Bangkok. The uh, uncarbonated Red Bull, which is the original Red Bull, by the way, if you didn't know. This one has B vitamins. Pretty good. This is exactly what I need to continue on my journey here. All right, so we're just kind of going for a wonder. The only thing I have planned is to check out this market. Who knows what else we'll see here. Um, this is where Maps is taking me, but truthfully, I wonder if there's a better way. No sidewalk. Maybe that's just the way it is. Ah, okay. Over here is a better way to walk. Alright, so I think we're getting close to the market here. Lots of stuff going on. People preparing. Seems like this is like a trading quarter, is what I would describe it as. It seems like there's a lot of wholesale movement of goods and items here uh yeah i would say this is like a trading quarter uh very interesting it feels like uh like old school like um you don't really see this too often in the u.s um so yeah i'm gonna let this go Maybe that was a mistake. Hello. Let's see what's down here. Again, 
if you know English or Spanish, you have a very easy time traveling here. I'm actually gonna zip my phone up here. Look at this, look at this car. Oh my gosh, I've never seen anything like this. That is a beautiful vehicle. Wow. Old school. All right, so hello. So this is the Vesoria public market maybe this is what i was looking for while well, we're here so let's go check it out hello no no can i film yeah thank you this is fish market fish market okay food mostly food mostly food here like yeah uh, food Ah, thank you. Okay, uh, where, if I want to buy, like... Okay. Okay, well, if I want to buy, like, shirts and, like, items, clothing, is that outside? Like, if I want to buy, like, goods, like, clothing, shoes... Third floor. Ah, thank you. Salma, thank you. Guys, so it turns out it's actually a fish market. And uh, I don't get down with fish. I don't love seafood. I was looking for more of an outdoor market and I think this is probably what it, what it is. So let's see what's around here. I mean, we have no shortage of items here. Hey Joe. So hello. How much your name? Bogey. Hello, Bogey. what's up bro? Oh, People, just so happy to see you here. Oh my gosh. Hello. And I gotta watch the traffic here. This is one of the craziest places I've ever been in my life. Truthfully. Um, okay. I have no plan, but I see like a bunch of stuff over here. So I think that's where we'll go. Ah, candy. Looks like uh, this is a great place if you want to buy like bulk, like bulk goods. Oh, look down there, we have like a bunch of stuff. Where do I go first? Hi. Hello. All right. All right, this is what I was looking for. So, yeah, we got like bulk fruits, bulk goods. Seems like a lot of people buying their items here. And yeah, I mean, look at this. Cars going right through. People moving merchandise and items here. So, wow. Hello. Hey bro, how much is a pineapple juice? 10 pesos. 10 pesos, all right, I got you, let's do it. Here's 20, that's for you, you can, you can keep, you can keep. Thank you. Thank you. Pineapple. Pineapple juice. I think it's street pineapple juice. Pineapple. I literally think it's like dull. You would get in like a can, but it's good. 
What's down in there? Hello. Hello, what is in there? Hello. What is it? What is in there? Clothes? Grocery. Shops? Yeah. Ah, all right, thank you. Salamat. Hello. Let's see what's in here. Hello. 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 How are you? Good, how are you? All right, let's see what's down here, guys. Hello. It's like bulk items for sale here. Some more stuff. Ah, and I think we can get to the other side of the market from here. And you can see, it goes on for quite a while. Wow. Hello. Okay. So much candy here. And oh my gosh. Guys, look at the scene here. I think this is the fresh fruit, fruit area. On the other side, I think was like bulk um, goods. You know what I really need, guys? This is strange, but I don't have a bottle opener. I'm thinking I can find a bottle opener here. There's one place I can find a bottle opener. It's the Divisoria Public Market. Maybe over here. Let's see, let's see. Closer. Bottle opener. Can opener. Do you have one? You got me. Uh, no, uh, small, small bottle opener, yeah, for beer. Ah, too big, too big, sorry bro, sorry. Small, small. Small. Perfect, all right. How much? 50. 50, I got you, all right. Thank you, sir, thank you bro, thank you bro. Oh, what's up, bro? All right. Well, that was not very hard. We got ourselves a bottle opener. So this is what we've acquired here. Bring it out in the light here. So you can see. You can see. Jar opener. All right. I wouldn't say it's unique, but it's exactly what I need. And nice to give them my business. Okay. So that is not dreadlocks. It's dog chains. Dog, uh, what are they called? Dog leashes. Okay, let's see what's over here. Oh my gosh. So many things. Hello. All right. Hardware items. We only had a Red Bull and a pineapple juice, so I'm gonna have to get some food eventually, but not right now. Hello? <laughs> Got Nike bags. The problem is, guys, if you've seen my other market videos, I do one bag. So, I don't uh, really need any other items. And so, <laughs> hello. So, I don't really need any other items. Maybe some shirts. Yes, I have like a bunch of black shirts. It just makes my life easier when I'm traveling. Some of you have commented, I only wear black shirts. It's true. Uh, I have some other gray ones too. But maybe we find a shirt or something. Okay. This is exactly what I was looking for. <coughs> when looking for a Filipino market, this is exactly what I was looking for. I mean, wow. Notice many people have uh, 
umbrellas. I've gotten quite sunburned here. Uh, and so umbrellas seem like a good idea. So Chato Chak Weekend Market in Bangkok is the largest weekend market in the world. Mango, but I'm gonna, gonna make a statement here. Porkina, porky, porky. You have to come to Divisoria Porkina, Market porky, porky, porky. on a Saturday because it's incredible. It might be better, honestly. Truthfully. It might not be as big, but wow. The musica, how much for uh 25 pesos only? Okay. 25 pesos only. Alright. Alright. Walker Joe. Thank you. Yes. I can't get it off. Alright. 25. Thank you. Salamat. Joe, one chef. Uh YouTube. YouTube vlogger, yes. Anang Kanglang Ma. What? Anang Kanglang Ma. What is your name? Destiny. Destiny. What's your name? Zane. Zane. Nice to meet you. It's a cool name. All right. So, if you haven't seen in my other videos, thank you. Mountain Dew in the Philippines is different. And yes, it's unhealthy. But you know what? You only live once. Mm. I think it's the bottle. You really can't beat 25 peso Mountain Dew in the Philippines. See this street here. I'm currently in the joy of getting lost. I have no idea where I am, and that's okay. Hey bro, what's up? Continuing my trend of sugar. Some of these candies are tempting me. I have to tell you, I really do. Okay. Hello, bro. What's up, bro? <laughs> Guys, come here. If you like to travel, come here. Oh my gosh. Amazing. Hello. Hey man, what's up? Alright. Ah, yes, I do think we've got turned around here. That's okay. There's a bunch I want to see. Hey man, what's up? Okay. What do you think guys? What do you think? What do you think guys? What looks good? Hello sir. Alright ma'am. Hello ma'am, how are you? Male or female? Alright guys. What do you think? Oh. I don't know. I think these are for a female. Who knows? Maybe they're unisex. I don't know. We've got driver's license stuff here. Hello. 35 pesos then. 35 pesos. Uh, these have... Okay, thank you. Salamat. Salamat, thank you. What is 
this. Happy Haas Donuts. Oh. Ooh. Do we try a strawberry donut? Oh man. Thinking we do. Hello. Uh, what is this flavor? What does it taste like? Like uh, peanut. Oh, uh, like peanut. Uh, strawberry. I'll do one strawberry. Uh, I think that'll be it. Yeah, thank you. 22. Let's see if I have it in here. I do not. Actually, I have two cents, so let me give you two cents. Okay, here is, uh, here's two cents for you. Two cents. Oh, two pesos, sorry. <laughs> Thank you. All right, guys. Take a look at this donut. Oh yeah. I think it's better than Dunkin' Donuts. No joke. Better than Krispy Kreme. Mm. So food recap today. I'm eating healthy. Red Bull, pineapple juice, Mountain Dew, donut. That's the way. My sugar high is nearing its capacity, so I might have to get something meat-based, chicken or something, I don't know. See the jeepney here? I will absolutely get on one of those before I leave. I'm not sure how you ride them. I'm assuming that's where it goes. Baclaran, La Guinto, Divisoria. I'm assuming that's the route it takes, but I have no idea. that in my first impressions video. Custard, jellies, beans, custard, jellies, fruit, ube, milk. It's really good, but I had too much sweets today. Can't eat anything else sweet for like, or drink anything sweet for many days, I think. That's probably a lot, but. And this Grizzlies, I think. Those look pretty sick. I have to say. Oh, the Supersonics, which are no longer a team. Looks sick, man. Hello. Oh, we've got traffic jam up here. Look at this. Oh. Hello. One piece. Do you have Do you have large large size? Yeah, I'm large. I'm large size. White? Large white. Ah. Do you have this do you have this one? Do you have this one large? 
Gotta get an anime shirt. I know. I bowed myself as a nerd on multiple occasions. It's okay. No more large. Oh, okay, not today. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Ah. Ah, sewing machine. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you. No, no, thank you. All right. So just making our way here through the market and very busy corner. All right, guys. Let's see what's over here. like this area you can get fresh fruits, vegetables. Deadlocked with traffic. What's up bro? <coughs> Alright, I'm thinking I want some noodles here. So, let's get in here. Alright, let's see what this food court's all about. I'm not sure what mall this is. I think this is different than the mall I was at in a previous video. Oh wow. Get this mini bazaar strip. Well, I think food will have to wait because I want to see what's in this mini bazaar. Okay, so it's sort of like out there, but now inside, moved inside. But I think even more. Hello. Hello. Sorry, thank you. Yes, sir. Hello, how, how's it going, guys? Okay. Hello. Hello. So that was the indoor bazaar. Let's see what the third floor is like. I think it's food. boutique center oh my gosh you have to come to this whole area divisoria market and then come inside and and experience this I think I've said it about four or five times but wow and I think the one I'm looking for is over here, chopsticks and spoon. And look at all these people eating, wow. Yeah, we're definitely going here. All right, let's see. Look at it, look at this. Yeah, definitely getting some chopsticks and spoon. Serving delicious, healthy, cooked meal. So, oh. oh, I think chicken adobo with egg and rice. Yeah, uh, chicken adobo yeah. with egg and rice. Uh -huh. I do one. Okay, over here. Four here, yes. Okay. I think uh, a water. Uh -huh. Okay. Seven. Yes. Right. Okay, I received two fifty. Uh -huh. 
This will be your number. Okay. Can you put this on your table? Okay. And uh, with the number facing us. Okay. Uh, we will serve the food to you okay, together great, with you. the change later on. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Have a nice day. You too. Oh, you can't. So I don't know why, but I was told I can't vlog in here. And I asked if I could vlog at a table. She said yes. I don't know. Alright, so sadly, as I've stated, I don't know how much I'm going to be able to get of this because I guess it's not video friendly. But this is uh, the uh, chicken adobo. And this, plus the water here, cost me 240 pesos, which is $4.60. So pretty incredible. Let's take a look here. So adobo is another thing in the Philippines that you have to try from what I understand and let's give this a shot mm. the chicken is so juicy it is really tender there's a bit of a spice but it's not spicy it's not hot let's try the rice mm. rice is good there's potatoes as well. It's hot. Oh man, the potatoes are so good. It's in some sort of like sauce, like close to a gravy. Yeah, the sauce is like a gravy. And of course you got that egg. Mm. Really good meal for $4.60, wow. Well, I think that just about wraps up probably one of the best experiences i've had not just traveling but in my life this was so cool so unique you have to come here i'll say it again i'll say it a million times everybody was so amazing everybody went out of their way to say welcome to the philippines what's up bro incredible experience thank you so much for being here i'm gonna certainly be talking to you again soon peace